Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. So in this video, I'm going to install Pixel Experience ROM on my Redmi Note 8. So currently, I'm using uh, Extended OS, which is based on Android 12, and it's running quite smoothly actually. So I, in my review video, I have said uh, something about orientation problem. So that problem is solved. It's because of some application in my phone was doing that. So I have uninstalled that app and it was solved. And other things about lag lag issue after uninstalling the app the lag issue also gone so the rom is quite good it's working just fine and today i'm going to install the pixel experience rom so the as you know uh, before doing any installation process you just back up your data uh, and keep it in your sd card or in your computer so because uh, i always recommend you to do clean flash because uh, that's actually mandatory doing clean flash otherwise it may cause some problem so first of all let's uh, jump into the recovery and finish the installation process uh, actually I have, I, I have used uh, pixel experience one previously and there was uh, I, I found some kind of problem those problems are like there was no MeCam, so which I like actually. Sometimes I use MeCam, so there was no MeCam, and also there was no Xiaomi ports, which unable uh, KKL support, which was not there. So I don't know now they in they uh, edited those features or not. Let's check. So we have done the wiping process. Now we are gonna install the ROM. So I have already downloaded the ROM into my micro SD card. And let's scroll down and as you can see pixel experience flash it so it's uh, included gfs also so let's see how long it takes So the ROM has booted up. Let's uh, finish the startup process. It's same as all the ROM, so I'm just fast forwarding it. So we are in the ROM now. So this is uh, a Pixel Experience ROM. Let's check. So it's uh, the main features of the Pixel experience room is this, it's very minimal, so there is no bloatware or anything else. As you can see, all the pixel uh, apps are there, and you are getting one camera app, which is not that good. I don't like this app application at all, and sometimes it's crash too. There is no features and anything, but it's working just fine. Uh, there is no issue, but I, I like MeCam uh, with the uh, what it called custom ROM, but uh, as we are getting this camera, I have no complaint about it. So, because I'm gonna use Gcam, so first of all, if I go to my device name, as you can see, Redmi Note 8, and it's running on Android 12, as you can see, then security patch is February 2022, and there is nothing actually new, everything is there, the same as Android 12, you are getting in other ROMs. And in this ROM, what you are not getting is that even subtle features also. So there is no customization at all. It's a bare bone um, stock ROM. And I was I'm looking for actually Xiaomi ports. So there is no Xiaomi ports also. That means you can't really change anything about like a display um, situation and other things, which actually I like to change because the skin burning issue of this phone. So if you change the dry, uh, if you have KKL support, then you may control the the skin burning issue a little bit. But it's not here. I'm looking for it, but it's not there. You can see here. So if you are really looking for a good ROM, which is there is no features and just bare bone stock, so you can download this ROM and you can flash this ROM. But I don't really like Pixel Experience ROM personally because of lack of even subtle features so that's that's why i don't really flash this one but 
to show you guys uh, i have flushed this rom and it's actually quite good rom for those who don't really uh, need any kind of features so this rom actually quite good rom and you will get what it called face and fingerprint unlock too and that's it everything is there calculator calendar and google apps so that's it for today i will give a review of this rom after using one or two days thank you very much for watching see you next time